Hey everybody, so today I'm going to be showing you how to create this really cute festival inspired look. We've got a Dutch braid going down the side of our fringe and we've also got a really cute floral headband. So if you want to see how I did this look, keep watching. So if you're going to a festival this year, this is going to be your number one must have product and that is dry shampoo. If you are at a festival, you're probably going to have second day, third day hair and it's going to be getting a little bit oily, a little bit greasy and it's going to be in need of a refresh. So the product that I'm going to be using first to do this is the Tresemme Instant Refresh Volumizing Dry Shampoo. Now this is great because it's really lightweight and it's completely invisible. It doesn't leave any of those nasty white patches that some dry shampoos do. So I'm just going to be spraying this all over my roots. So as you can see that's already added loads of volume as well. So once you've applied dry shampoo it's on to the next product and that is the VO5 Give Me Texture Dry Texturizing Spray. This is great for prepping your hair for styling because it makes every style that you do grip really easily and it doesn't leave your hair feeling sticky at all. So this is just going to help our braid stick and sit better. So again I'm going to apply that to the roots and my fringe which is the main area of this look but I will probably run it a little bit through my lengths as well. And so once you have completely prepped your hair for styling, it's time to actually start doing the braid. So I'm just going to brush through the hair to make sure it's easy to braid. So I'm going to take a section of hair and I'm going to split that into three sections. And then the outside sections are going to go underneath the middle section. So this is a Dutch braid. Outside section goes underneath the middle section. Underneath the middle section tighten it up and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add in a piece of hair. So I'm going to add this piece of hair into the middle section. I'm going underneath the middle section, tightening up, adding in hair to the middle section, going underneath the middle section, tightening up and adding in hair to that middle section again and then going underneath middle section. You're just going to keep doing that until you get around to your ear. And so it's up to you what you do now. If you want you could carry this on and have it as a plait all the way down or you could plait it and then take it around the back so you've got a pretty plait. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pin it around the back there and then bring the rest of my hair forward. So I just pulled a little bit out to make it look a little bit looser. I'm just going to secure it with a bobble. I'm just going to clip that behind using some curvy grips. And once you've got a look that you're happy with, you can maybe zhuzh up your hair a little bit or you could add some curls or something like that to it. You're just going to use some hairspray to set the style. So the hairspray that I'm going to be using is the VO5 Firm Hold Weather Resistant Hairspray. This hairspray is great because it holds well, it's really long lasting and it doesn't make your hair sticky like a lot of hairsprays do. So I'm just going to use this hairspray over the braid to make sure that it stays in place. And of course it wouldn't be a festival look without a floral headband. So I'm just going to be popping on this one. It's just a really cute pink floral one with some spikes on it to add a bit of a grungy festival vibe. So I'm literally just going to pop that on and that completes the look. Just a really nice, simple Dutch braid perfect for festival season. And there you go, that is the finished festival look. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, if you want to like and subscribe to the All Things Hair channel, that would be great and I will see you very soon. Thank you for watching. Bye!